following Adam and Eve, Abraham and Noah, God now gave his next set of rules to Moses. And in today's lesson, we want to find out exactly what these rules, laws, or as they're more commonly known, commandments were. To do this, you're going to use the Bible that you have been issued by your teacher. You're going to use how to learn the Bible in order to find out exactly what these Ten Commandments were. This becomes an easier task once you know how to do it. So firstly, let's explain what the Bible is one more time. The Bible is, as it says here, a library, a collection of books. But it can be broken down into two bigger sections, the Old Testament and the New Testament. The Old Testament written before Jesus was born and the New Testament written in the life or about the life of Jesus. Within each of these testaments are lots of books. Each of these books can be broken down into chapters and the chapters down again into verses. Now, the directions on this screen show you what we mean by books, chapters and verses. The first thing you may just want to do is to open the Bible randomly at four separate locations and just make a note of the name of the book that you are looking at. It's marked in the bold writing in the top corners of the pages. Each of these books is then broken down into chapters. Now these chapters are marked down here with the slightly bolder, bigger number to identify the chapter. Finally, the verses are the smallest of all the numbers. These verses indicate the smallest sections of the Bible books. Therefore, in our example up here, we are looking at the book of Exodus. We are looking at chapter 20, verses 2 through to 17. Once again, illustrated here is the way in which we're going to use these instructions. You are going to look from chapter 20, verses 2 to 17. And you are going to write down the list of the commandments. What I'd also like you to do is leave a line between each example. Because you, I would like you to consider what those commandments actually mean in modern English. Please pause the film. What you should have written down are the commandments written here. And underneath each of these commandments, I would like you to try and write down what exactly you understand they mean in modern English. Please pause the film. So here is an example of what we think the Ten Commandments might look like if they were written today in modern English. Put God first. Worship only God. Use God's name with respect. Remember to have a rest day every week. Respect your parents. Don't hurt others. Be faithful in marriage. Don't steal. Don't lie. And don't be jealous. Please correct, add or change the answers that you got to reflect what you have found out here. Please pause the film. Finally, let's do some written work to summarise and explain fully what we've learnt in today's lesson. Firstly, do you think the Ten Commandments are good rules for today and why? Could you please answer this question fully? I think that the Ten Commandments are Make your choice and explain your reasons why. Please remember the rules of point evidence analysis. Secondly, which are good rules and why? Please again explain in full, fully explained responses. I think the following rules are good because. Follow that up with which ones are not relevant today and why. 
Are there any rules the Ten Commandments have missed out that you would think much more helpful to have as rules today? And finally, use the Bible again to discover who God asked to pass on the Ten Commandments to the people. Please, when you found the name of the person, tell me where in the Bible you found your answer. Finally, your extension task. Please consider putting the Ten Commandments into just two rules. Jesus did, and subsequently, in later lessons, we will look at his rules in more detail.